First, dismount the covers and remove the cardan shaft. Next, use the stone to dress the flange face on the stationary shaft. Check the runout of the flange face using a dial indicator. Lock the stationary shaft so that it does not rotate. The cardan kit includes two steel spacers. Place each spacer between the cardan fixture and the stationary coupling face. Bolt the arm to the flange. The washers will go in between the arm and the fixture. You can use one or two arms. Mount the turret to the arm. Find the right location for the stationary turret by turning on its aiming laser and adjusting the arm until the laser strikes the center of the movable shaft. Here are mounting alternatives for the stationary turret. The cardan kit has a selection of threaded nuts. Select the appropriate size for your coupling and mount it. Next, mount the turret to the nut and turn on the laser. The aiming laser can be used to rough a line. Here are mounting alternatives for the movable turret. Mount the sensors on the turrets. Select the cardan application from the main screen. Next, select the measurement icon. Enter the dimensions between the two mounted laser sensors and the motor's feet. Measure the misalignment at 9, 3, and 12 o'clock. The angle of the stationary sensor and the angle of the movable sensor should be matched within two tenths of a degree at each measurement location. Evaluate the results. Use the as-found results to correct the misalignment. Tighten the bolts on the movable machine. And finally, remeasure to verify that your machine is aligned.